Hello and welcome once again to some more Snooker 19 and part 81 of season 3 of our Ronnie O'Sullivan career mode. Today we hopefully finish off the match in the, the quarterfinal against Judd Trump. We are currently an amazing 10 frames to 2 up and I know people have been commenting about uh, the difficulty and, and you know... As always, I assure you guys that the, the difficulty is always on the hardest. Yes, the Aim and Aid is on Pro Plus, but if you've watched this season, you will know whenever, um, you know, we've lost a, a, a lot of matches on Pro Plus, and, and we moved up to Master Plus uh, a little bit earlier in the season uh, for, for three episodes, I think, while I was practicing for the Virtual Worlds, and, uh, you know, we lost both matches on it so you know I, it's just the way it goes sometimes you play really well and the, the AI don't necessarily turn up and Judd Trump hasn't turned up in this match yet he's 10-2 behind he still could come back and win this match that's how crazy the AI can be sometimes and I think that the two frames he's won he's won them in one visit so you know I think it's more down to me playing well than the difficulty uh, being too low but uh, anyway it is uh, time for frame 13. Obviously, if we win three of today's four uh, frames, then we will be through to the semi-final and continue in our defence of this wonderful World Championship trophy. That's a good break. And remember, we're going for the big seven this year, equaling Stephen Hendry's record of World Championship victories as a possible opening chance just a little bit more tricky because we, we actually have to screw this back this is not so easy. I have to play this at pace Impressive but it's gone in mm. one no, not perfect yeah not the blue uh, Yellow around the angles, hopefully. Here it comes. Are we going to end up on that red? Are we going to end up on that red? Well, look at that. <laughs> Could have played that shot all day and it not go that way. And that's exactly what's what's happening for us at the moment. We just seem to be, you know, getting the, the run of the ball. Um... You know, a little bit more often than we normally would. Four. This is a great chance to get into the reds now. I still can't believe that positional shot. Oh, uh, but here we go. Oh, where's the red going? Oh, it nearly went into the middle, but look where the whites ended up. 11. So there you go. That's end of break. What are you meant to do with this? Tempted to try and stick him behind the black here. I'll do. You've got the snooker. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 11. He'll be aware of the risks associated with playing this with too much pace. Well, he was in a big heap of trouble there. One. But uh, we haven't played the, the best shot ever there. So tricky ping into the middle. No more than half a chance here. Nope. Pink isn't there. And he's missed that. Got the easy One. red. One. There's still a couple of Going Pots. for the left corner pocket. For Judd. One or two mm. mistakes starting to creep into his game. He needs to regain his focus here. And this is exactly what's been going on all match. Judd Trump just can't get his long game going. Well, he's looking mm. at potting this into the right corner pocket. Uh, now we're back at the table with another chance. No issues there. Wonderful shot. One. Drop this pink in. Mm. 
Nicely played. Played it well. Seven. But yeah, you know, talking about the difficulty, if we do win this World Championship, I am going to trial Master Plus at the start of next season. Nicely onto so, the colour. You know, hopefully we'll... Eight. Let's see. I would say a bit more challenge, but, uh, you know, season one is still our most successful season, and we've never really recaptured that form. Um, that wasn't the best shot in the world. Our positional play has just not been good enough. He's played that very well with the rest. 16. Can't quite get to enough of the pink, so... Blue it is, so still not in ideal position. That looks pretty good. That's almost perfect. 21. Played for this red next to the pink. 22. So we knew we could get a nice position on the pink after it. Get it back on its spot. 28. This is a great opportunity now to take an 11 frames to 2 lead and I'm just baffled at how we're in this position now. Um, you know, potentially winning the match with a session to spare. Thirty-five. But, you know, still got to keep focused. Pop the balls. 36. 43. Yeah, probably play this one into the, the corner here. It's a pretty straight shot. Good uh, opportunity to get that red. Out of the way. 49. So, just the red required here. There it is, 11 2. No problem there. That should be it. No real way for his opponent to win the frame now. No issues there. And that shuts the door on his opponent in this frame. 57. So red into the green pocket. Not an easy one, but a half chance. Yep, it's there. Unbelievable pot. 58. Oh, double kiss on that red was trying to bring it into play. No, double kiss. Just meant uh, that stayed close to the cushion. It should be absolutely fine though. Probably stun up for the red in bulk here. 65. Need to get onto that red. There you go. Seventy two. Good position. Could actually go into that red here. Ah, missed the red. Well, it doesn't matter. That break of seventy two gives us the first frame of the day. And we lead by 11 frames to 2 now. O'Sullivan, 72. Frame conceded. Frame, Ronnie O'Sullivan. And that is the frame. Thank you, frame 14. Should Trump to break. So 
to Trump breaks off in frame 14 and well, he's again played it quite attacking so. he's tempted by this red red near the pocket well, that's an unforced error but that's gone wrong one I didn't mean to nominate the yellow there don't think we can quite get to the black See if we can somehow get to the the green. Yeah, just in in trouble here. And it's quite fancy us to <laughs> lose the frame after this. He's trying to be as risk averse as possible here. Trying to hit the yellow. Not quite. Playing it in a way. But hasn't really worked out. Well, we knew we wouldn't foul and a miss. Have left him anything Daniel easy. Sullivan. One. Judd Trump. Four. Oh dear. Well, <laughs> it's as if he's our practice partner and he's trying to give us opportunities. That was a terrible safety. I don't really know why he didn't put us back in there, but hey ho. One. It's not really what we can. Do just got to play what we're given. Well um, played. Hey. We know we can't take this lightly because Judd Trump will eventually start playing the way that we all know he can. We've seen it so many times in the past. Selby's done it to me before. Um, you know, where he's been playing terrible for most of the match, and then all of a sudden. Start knocking in sentry break after sentry break. He's lost the cue ball a touch here. Yeah, Nine. Down to the pink there. And succeeded with that. It's not an easy shot, but one late towards the left middle pocket. I fancy knocking in. Just about drops. Beautifully done. What so, a good what chance a now to. Finish off this frame and right corner here. Excellent pot. Really impressive. Okay, just one frame away from the semi finals. Well, of course, last year we played Karen Wilson and had a really good match with them. 17 15 that one ended. Just think. Twenty-four. It's going to be. Thirty-one. Well, that's gone a bit wrong. Just think. I have a feeling it's going to be a, a, a shock player in the semi-final. Looking at this red. Assuming we get there. What an excellent pot! It would be is. quite the comeback from Trump now if he was to He's played this match. Well. Thirty to uh, Yeah, don't think we've ever had a right corner. Nicely done. Such a dominant victory. Really good. Thirty seven. Thirty eight. Played that okay. Forty five. Could have done a little better, perhaps, but all right. Nicely on the blue. Forty six. Yeah, played yeah. it well. Fifty-one. So already forty-eight points in front here. 
52. So we're going to play it with just a touch of check side to try and stay on these two reds. I'm not sure why he played it like that. Oh, well, 59. it's gone wrong. Uh, that's crazy. But can play the plant. It's not easy. But it's there. Played it with an element of safety. Because I'm conscious that Judd can still win this. So it's this pink chance, needs to go in. Nonetheless. It's not there. Oh, it is! It just dropped in. And the cue ball has finished very nicely. So just this red required. It just needs the red. And there it is. Wonderful shot. And that effectively shuts out his opponent in this frame. So I do apologise that this match has not, you know, potentially had the drama that we probably all expected it would. But uh, played that very well. You know, there's not a lot I can really do about it. I've just been given the chances, and we we generally took them. It'd be nice to get another ton. 80. Against Liang. Uh, you know, we played really well, beat him 10 1 nice in, on the the, in the first round. And 81. Beaten Mark Williams. 11 7, uh, 13 7, but it was a very close match that one. You know, it was only the odd frame between us until 6 all and we won four in a row. Goes. Half a chance. And that's really what changed that match. Brilliant, brilliant pot. 89. So, that match could have went either way. Potential ton coming up here. Challenging pot along the cushion here. Ah, oh, it misses. Never mind. That break of 95 gives us the frame. And we're just one frame away from the semi finals now. That's the frame in the bag. Thank you, frame 15. Ronnie O'Sullivan to break. There we go. Ready and raring to go. With another frame. This time, not the best break off, but we get away with it. Please don't just end up in the bottom of the pack. He's overhit it a bit, I think. Yeah, it's a chance. Well, he's taking it on. And it's there. Uh, a chance off this One. blue. Just going to double check that. Those two reds at the bottom of the pack. They are not a plant. So I'm hoping. We're all keen to go into these. Just straight into the pink. Got to hit the pink full ball here. Plenty of power. That's a good split. That's exactly what we do. And look at these reds now. How's our luck? Are we on anything? Might be on the red to the left corner. Yeah, just about. So, a bit of left hand side here just to stay on the black. That's good. Seven. I think we can screw directly into these reds here. You'd feel we'd be unlucky not to be on one. Yeah, played it okay. Not perfect, but can still knock this in. He's taking on the pot along the cushion. Oh no, it's not there. It's not there, so... Judd Trump. And this is your chance now. <laughs> you got to win 11 frames in a row.
to win this match. Can you start by at least winning this one? Strokes oh, in good blue. Great blue. Six. Oh, oh! I thought he'd missed that. Seven. I think he probably did as well. I just can't believe how badly he's playing. Fourteen. These reds are beautifully split. Decent position to take on a colour here. Fifteen. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Twenty-nine. Thirty. Yeah, played that well. To drop into the pocket. Thirty seven. Thirty eight. So thirty eight points already the break and forty five. That's a great pot. Oh, wonderful! Took a long shot. pot on, and he's knocked a couple in in this frame. But again, he's not perfect on the blue to get onto the next red. May even try and screw back off the yellow. No, he's just dropping in the blue. He's going to play this down the cushion. This is his first big test of a shot. It's got to go in. What could be his last shot of this year's Betfred World Championship. He's aiming for the left corner here. Oh, it's there. Great shot. Wonderful pot. Well played. 52. So, shouldn't be anything stopping him winning this frame now and prolonging the match. One more frame. Nicely positioned for the black. 58. So there goes the black. 65. So he's 51 points in front. 59 on the table. Just this red required. And there it is. What a pot. And that effectively shuts out his opponent in this frame. Well, do well to get on to the next red here. Excellent queuing. He might have played that beautifully. I think he has done. The red to the just bottom left of the pink. Yeah, perfect. So, cheering him on now to try and make the sentry. Would be very nice to see. Down it goes. 75. Nicely onto the black. 76. 83. He's just looking to drop this in gently. 84. 84. Aiming for the centre pocket here. 90. He's on the green. 92. 95. 95. He's got nice position well, on the blue. Just the blue for the turn. 99. And there it is. Fabulous entry from Joe Trump. Brilliant century. To keep his hopes.
We're live. Great queuing there. He'll be thrilled with that. So that brilliant break of 117 gives him the frame. Well played. But he still needs a further 10 frames to win this match. It's 12-3 now. So Judd Trump breaks off in the final frame of this episode, final frame of the session. And what we hope is going to be shot coming up. the decisive one. That's an excellent opening red. One. Off the opening red. So straight into these reds. Don't want to go into them too hard. Got that red. The split looks good to me. At the bottom of the pack. And another one has just developed there. Become even Eight. easier, which is good. This looks relatively easy. So I'm just trying to... Position looks good for a colour. Drop these in. Again, just a, just a little cannon into the reds. Always guaranteed that one at the bottom of the cluster, so just bringing more reds into play. Believe it or not, I've got another chance here, but I'm not going to bother this time. Very Couple nicely reds. done. At the bottom of the pack. This one first. Nice position on the black. 25. Yeah, might have to go into them this time. Just got to be a bit careful, just checking there's no obvious plants. That's a great split. You'll be unlucky That's if you okay. anything here. 32. Yeah, got this one up into the top pocket. It's not the easiest shot. Here. That's a top shot. Well played. He seems full of confidence at the moment. 33. 38. This is a great opportunity now. He's critical here. Clear cut chance to win the frame. And with it the match and a place in the semi-finals. Forty-six. He's playing this into the right centre pocket. Forty-seven. Gonna have to play another cannon here. I really didn't want to have to do. 54. But, okay. Well, he's lost the cue ball touch. Would have wanted that under better control, really. I had a slight fear the cue ball was going to just drop there, but it's okay. 60. Not a million miles away from securing this match now. To sink this into the left corner pocket. This red, the black, what a top and one more red. Is. Great queuing. So, 61. Looking to play this. Top spin. Power. That's coming round. That's, that's not bad. I'll play the one up into the yellow pocket, 58. I think. This for a place in the semi final. Just this red needed. And it's there. Where's the cue ball going? He's gone in well, wow. frustrating. Foul. Can you believe Foul. it? 68. The red went in, we flicked off the other red and went into the left middle pocket. This won't be easy. So Judd Trump 
is still in this match. And that red is right in the heart of the pocket. Fabulous. Can he keep this match yeah. alive? He just wants to slot this into the middle pocket. That blue put some 59 points. No, sorry, 58 points behind. Not an easy one. He needs to get onto the black. Nah, he's going to need a snooker here. What a He's going to need a snooker. And it's such a shame. That would have been drama. So, this but, pot uh, right corner. Playing the brown. Well, an excellent pot. Secures his fate. He does require a snooker now. 11. And you just know fine well he's going to pot the red and tuck us behind. Oh no, he's playing the snooker now. He's trying to get it behind the black. That's well, he's got it. Good right. shot. Should trump 11. So. He'll be desperate to avoid the foul here, as it'll open the door for his opponent. He's got to drop onto them, and that's what we've done. Just the one snooker required for, for Judd. So he's <laughs> battling hard here. He'll want to get this cue ball close to the cushion. Stranger things have happened in snooker. Put this. Just put it over the corner pocket. Mm, that kiss on the brown means we can see it. So that's match over now. For Judd Trump. Decent position to take on a colour here. A mighty relief from us that we've took this. Well, we've done the Steve Davis 1985 shot there. I massively overcut the black. I don't think it'll matter, though. Judd Trump comes forward and shakes our hand, and we're into the semi-final. That's a great performance to take him into the semi-final. We beat the ace in the pack, Judd Trump, by 13 frames to three. And look at that. Uh, total points... 13-29, lots of more points than, than Judd Trump in that match. And, and we, we dominated proceedings uh, from start to finish, really. A couple of frames early on went our way that really shouldn't have. And I think that just changed the complexion of the match. And we win with a session to spare and we're through to the semi-final. So who are we going to be playing in that semi-final then? Neil Robertson. Well, that's a little bit of a surprising semi-finalist, I must say. Uh, we haven't played Neil Robertson a great deal in this career mode, but certainly a player that I respect a lot, and I think this could be an absolute cracker, to be honest, in the semi-final, which will be coming up in a couple of days' time. Of course, we'll have our experiments again tomorrow as uh, just a little break, and because we won it with a session to spare, I think I might also splice in one of the uh, the online matches uh, that I've been playing in a in a uh, snooker league currently. So in a couple of days' time, we'll be back with uh, this series, and uh, I can't wait to get into the semi-finals. So if you have enjoyed that, make sure you leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for daily snooker nineteen videos. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.